हेलो एवरीवन रीडिंग ऑफ द डे आई एम जाने आलम असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर ऑफ एक्सिस इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ फार्मेसी टुडे आई एम डिस्कसिंग टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द ह्यूमन एनाटॉमी एंड फिजियोलॉजी नाउ व्हाट इज द ह्यूमन एनाटॉमी एंड फिजियोलॉजी एनाटॉमी मींस स्टडी ऑफ द स्ट्रक्चर स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द सेल्स ऑर्गन्स एंड टिश्यूज एंड फिजियोलॉजी स्टडी ऑफ द फंक्शंस नाउ मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड objective what the objective of the human anatomy and physiology the relationship between the structure and functions of the various uh, various systems as cellular levels tissue levels and organ levels there are now second point is the various homeostatic mechanism uh, homeostatic mechanism positive feedback mechanism and negative feedback mechanism homeostatic homeo means constant or fairly constant static means state it is defined as to tightly control the fluctuation and variation within of the bodies with, within body and the various types of the tissues in human body uh, connective tissue epithelial tissue muscular tissue and nervous tissue and the working pattern of the organs at different different levels this is the objective of the human anatomy and physiology course outcomes course outcomes the Uh, relationship and the uh, knowledge of the morphology and uh, function of the various types of the tissues and understanding of the skeleton system skeleton system divided in the axial skeleton system and appendicular skeleton system joint three types of the joints and uh, and types of the bones different types of the bone in the human bodies and uh, next point is the hemopoiesis and blood group clotting mechanisms clotting mechanism and cardiovascular systems and the different types of the technique used in human anatomy and physiology labs technique and procedures this is the outcomes of the human anatomy and physiology now moving to the next slide the scope what is the scope of human anatomy and physiology the fundamental knowledge of the various organs nervous various organs and systems and uh, nervous systems and respiratory system digestive system skeleton system muscular systems reproductive system different types of the systems and the understanding of the mechanisms and uh, basic knowledge required to understand the various disciplines of the pharmacy and this effective surgery and effective treatment of the disease now moving to the next slide this is the first unit first unit the covers the first unit isme cover karenge hum human introduction of human anatomy cellular organization and tissue levels this course contains one definition of anatomy and physiology and homeostatic mechanisms and cellular levels and what is the cells types of the cells or organelles iske bare mein hum discuss karenge first unit mein this is the overview of the first units and tissues different types of the tissues Uh, muscular tissues epithelial tissue connective tissue and nervous tissue and uh, this is the first unit first unit of the human anatomy and physiology anatomy what is the anatomy ana means up atho means cut it is the scientific study of the structures and physiology uh, scientific study of the functions function of the cells tissues and organs Uh, physiology divided into gross anatomy and microscopic anatomy gross and, uh, anatomy means study of a particular area surface area regional anatomy developmental and systemic anatomy and microscopic anatomy study of the cytology cyto means cells cells means cells ki study and uh, histology is to uh, study of the tissue and uh, tissue and tissue structures this is the first unit content now moving to the next slide level of the organizations cells cells uh, a group of the molecules and uh, uh, tissues tissues is the group of the cells similar cells group of the similar cells organs and organ system this is the also part of the unit first now moving to next slide basic life processes life process metabolism metabolism divided into catabolism and metabolism catabolism means cut breakdown of the larger molecules into simple molecule anabolism is building up the smaller molecules into 
complex molecules. Responsiveness, already recognize and detect the stimulus and response against them. And respiration, exchanges of gases between the internal and external environment. Homeostasis, positive feedback mechanism and negative feedback mechanism. Positive feedback mechanism makes the abnormal condition more abnormal and negative feedback mechanism uh, maintain the fluctuation within the body. If the fluctuation and variables going up or down from the normal, uh, from normal level, negative feedback mechanism set within the set point. This is the second unit. In second unit, we will learn about skin, ke bare mein, skin ki layer, ke bare mein, functions. Ke bare mein. And skeleton system. Skeleton system divided into the uh, divided in two parts: axial skeleton system and appendicular skeleton systems, and types of joints and types of the joint and movements of the articulations. This is the unit of first, second unit, skeleton system. The skeleton, skeleton system, structure and function of the skin. Second unit may hum padenge structure and function of the unit and skeleton system and part of the skeleton system and types of the joints and, uh, jo and joints and articulations this is the second unit of human anatomy and physiology bp 101t uh, structure of the skin epidermis divided into five layers stratum corneum granulosum lucidum and spinulosum and germination dermis and hypodermis and now third unit third unit hemopoietic system body fluid uh, formation of rbc wbc and uh, anemia mechanism of coagulation this is the part of the second unit and lymphatic system lymphatic dust lymphatic vessels and lymph circulations this is the unit third uh, first year student unit third ke bare mein hum padhenge. This is the hemopoiesis, hemopoiesis formations of the RBC in bone marrow, ferrous, globulin, vitamin B12 and erythropoietin combined together and form erythropoiesis process take in uh, place in red bone marrow. Formation of RBCs come into the circulation, the life of the RBC 120 days and destroy in the spleen. RBC destroy in the spleen and globin convert into amino acid and help in the protein synthesis and heme uh, convert into transferrin and bilirubin goes into liver uh, then secrete through the feces this is the hemopoiesis blood plasma to the lymph and lymphatic system lymph watery fluid just like a plasma composition bilkul plasma ki tarah hota lymph ka or lymph bilkul watery fluid hota hai or lymph comes from the capillaries and this is the left ventricle pumps the blood into the uh, arteries and uh, comes in the capillaries capillaries filtrate the lymph into the lymphatic vessels lymphatic vessels drain into the lymphatic node and lymphatic node drain the blood into the uh, vein this is the circulation of the limbs now the first now this is the fourth unit of human anatomy and physiology peripheral nervous system classification of peripheral nervous system sympathetic nervous system and parasympathetic nervous system and special senses sympathetic and parasympathetic nervous system you can see here sympathetic nervous system it is outflow from the uh, thoracolumbar regions outflow from the thoracolumbar regions presynaptic neuron Presynaptic uh, neuron is short and postsynaptic neuron is long. Presynaptic neuron containing neurotransmitter acetylcholine and postsynaptic neuron containing adrenaline dopamine. This is the parasympathetic nervous system. Parasympathetic nervous system, presynaptic neuron uh, outflow from the sacral from the cranium and the sacral regions. Uh, presynaptic neuron are long and postsynaptic neuron are short. And presynaptic neuron also contain CH and pre and post both uh, neurons contain uh, neurotransmitter uh, neurotransmitter acetylcholine. This is the fourth unit of the human anatomy and physiology.
यूनिट फिफ्थ कार्डियो वस्कुलर सिस्टम कार्डियो मीन्स हार्ट वस्कुलर मीन ब्लड वेसल्स इन दिस यूनिट हम पढ़ेंगे हार्ट के बारे में और हार्ट के लेयर्स के बारे में चैम्बर्स के बारे में तो हार्ट क्या है हार्ट एक होलो मस्कुलर ऑर्गन से इसमें तीन लेयर होती हैं एपिकार्डियम मायोकार्डियम एंड एंडोकार्डियम मायोकार्डियम जो होती है हार्ट की 90 परसेंट होती है पूरे हार्ट की उसके बाद में इसमें जो इन्फीरियर वेनी इन्फीरियर वेनागावा और सुपीरियर वेनागावा की हेल्प से ब्लड आता है राइट एंटीरियम में देन द ट्राइकस फिड वॉल्व और एटीरियो वेंटिकुलर वॉल्व ओपन दैन ब्लड कम्स इन टू द राइट वेंट्रिकल्स राइट वेंट्रिकल्स पम्प द ब्लड इन टू पलमोनरी आर्टरी ओपन द पलमोनरी वॉल और सेमिलोनर वॉल दैन ब्लड गोज टू द लंग्स इन लंग्स ऑक्सीजनेशन टेक प्लेस एंड कैरिंग द ऑक्सीजन फ्रॉम द लंग्स ब्लड पलमोनरी वेन्स कम पलमोनरी वेन जो है वो ब्लड लेके आती है लेफ्ट एटीरियम में और लेफ्ट एटीरियम ड्रेन कर देता है ब्लड लेफ्ट वेंट्रिकल में लेफ्ट वेंट्रिकल पंप करती है कोरोनरी आर्टरी में और कोरोनरी आर्टरी रोटा में उसके बाद में पूरी बॉडी में ब्लड का सर्कुलेशन हो जाता है तो दिस इज चार्ज फोर चैम्बर होते हैं हार्ट में राइट एटीरियम राइट वेंट्रिकल लेफ्ट एटीरियम लेफ्ट वेंट्रिकल और चार चैम्बर चार चैम्बर होते हैं चार वॉल्व होते हैं ट्राइकस फिड वॉल्व या और एटीरियो वेंट्रिकुलर वॉल्व और पल दो सेमिलोनर वॉल्व होते हैं पलमोनरी वॉल और कोरोनरी जो आपके जो कोरोनरी आर्टरीज में होते हैं वो आपके सेमिलोनर वॉल्व होते हैं और आपके इधर जो लेफ्ट साइड में होते हैं इधर जो वॉल्व होते हैं वो आपके मिट्रल वॉल्व और एटीरियो वेंटिकुलर वॉल्व होते हैं ठीक है दिस इज द फिफ्थ यूनिट ऑफ फिफ्थ यूनिट ऑफ ह्यूमन एनाटोमी एंड फिजियोलॉजी दिस लेयर ऑफ लेयर ऑफ हार्ट वॉल We have discussed about the layers. This is the uh, epicardium. Epicardium first layer of the heart. Epicardium first layer divided into three part. Epicardium is further divided into three part: fibrous layer, pericardial, uh, parietal pericardial, and visceral cardiac. It's containing the cavity, pericardial cavity. Pericardial cavity contain the fluid near about 30 mL of the fluid. It reduces the friction between the layers of the heart. so this is the pericardium first layer of the heart this structure shows the pericardium only per, only pericardium of first layer and uh, this is the myocardium a middle layer and endocardium we have discussed about only pericardium in this slide now this is the suggested book for human anatomy and physiology rose and wilson and tortora for b form first years and thank you